area's certified, most accurate forecast six years in a row. Meteorologist Chad Raithlisberger. A little more cloud cover across our northern counties, keeping those areas a little bit cooler here this afternoon. And a few rain showers falling from a few of those clouds as well. Let's look outside right now on our Storm Team 5 Skyview camera in Sturgeon Bay. As we look towards the north and west, 39 degrees. And we wouldn't be surprised if there are a few uh, light rain showers uh, around the Sturgeon Bay area. We'll get to the radar here in just a moment as we make our way now to Green Bay. 54 with a mix of sun and clouds. A nice view as we look towards downtown Green Bay. Again, temperatures a little bit cooler, mid to upper 30s across the far northern portions of the viewing area, but more spring like 60 right now in Fond du Lac and in Sheboygan, and 52 right now right along the lakeshore in Manitowoc. Winds have been breezy this morning and through the afternoon, generally out of the north to northwest at 10 to 20 miles an hour. We have a weak little system off to the north and west, and so you can see a little cloud cover here this afternoon, those clouds starting to break up and give way to more sunshine, mainly south of Green Bay. But again, across the northern portions of the viewing area, a little more cloud cover. And yeah, there are a couple of little light rain showers just north of Surgeon Bay right now. Some light rain towards the uh, Escanaba area, back towards Iron Mountain, maybe mixing in with some wet snowflakes just to the north of Iron Mountain as well. Areas generally north of, say, Marinette towards Sturgeon Bay, the best chance at a couple sprinkles or a light rain shower for the rest of the afternoon and evening. Otherwise, a fairly quiet forecast expected over the next several hours. Notice more rain and clouds off to the south and west. We will not have to worry about that for tonight. So we do have winter storm watches in effect. Now for the northern half of the state of Wisconsin, that goes into effect Wednesday evening. Runs through the afternoon hours on Thursday. It's areas north and west of Green Bay that have the best chance at receiving the heaviest snowfall totals from this next system that arrives late Wednesday, continues Thursday, and into at least the first half of the day on Friday. So in the short term, again, a couple spotty showers to the north this evening. Otherwise, we're looking at a dry forecast through the overnight. Still dry on Wednesday morning. However, notice the first round of snow just off to our south and west. By about this time tomorrow, we'll see those clouds continue to increase throughout the afternoon hours on Wednesday. It looks like Futurecast trying to slow down the arrival time of this initial band of snow. However, Wednesday night into Thursday morning, here comes that snow. So your Thursday morning commute will certainly be a slow going. And as we head through the afternoon hours then on Thursday, warmer air starts to move in. So that snow will eventually switch over to a wintry mix. And then, likely for many of us, over to all rain late Thursday and Thursday night. Here are the snowfall totals, however, before we uh, even get to that switchover by Thursday morning. So again, your morning commute on Thursday could be quite slow with anywhere from two to maybe as much as five inches of snowfall across the area. These totals will then start to lower as we start to see some of that wintry mix and rain melt some of that snow Thursday afternoon and evening. So again, the snow arrives late Wednesday, continues through at least the first half of the day on Friday. Starts as some wet snow late Wednesday, switches over to a wintry mix and rain by Thursday afternoon, 2 to 5 for many of us by Thursday morning, but you get mainly north and west of Anago, some areas up across north central Wisconsin could see upwards of a half foot of snow by early Friday. So your forecast for tonight calls for partly cloudy skies. Again, a couple of light rain showers to the north with temperatures falling to near 30. And then for your Wednesday, wet snow arrives late Wednesday evening into Wednesday night with high temperatures right around 40. Your seven day planner has that snow switching over to a wintry mix and rain Thursday afternoon. A couple of spotty showers Friday. Right now your weekend looking fairly quiet. For more on your forecast, you can find it on our Facebook page, WFRV Local 5. So don't pack away the shovel just yet. Not yet. Not All yet. right. We thank you okay. much. And we're back right after this. Stick with us.